We had reported yesterday that the French government has offered 36 additional Rafale fighter jets, 6 Airbus A330 refuelers and 111 AS565 Panther helicopters under a new 5 billion euros package deal to the Indian government. And according to latest French media report, the French government has offered the latest F-4 standard Rafale fighter jets to India under this package deal, and it will feature improved radar system, upgraded sensors and front sector optronics, helmet-mounted display capabilities, Dalio's targeting laser designator pod, integration of next-generation Meteor and Mica air-to-air systems and the 1000 kg hammer laser guided air-to-ground systems. The F-4 will also include a new diagnostic aid system and artificial intelligence solutions that will introduce predictive maintenance capabilities. The program director of the Aeronautical Development Agency has said that the metal cutting of the medium-weight fighter also known as the Tejas Mark II has started and the entire process will be completed by the end of 2021 and the first aircraft will start ground testing by March 2022, followed by its first flight by the end of 2022. He also informed that the detailed design phase of the AMCA has started, including the realization of various line replaceable modular units. He also said that a full-scale model is also in a very advanced stage that will be used to measure its stealth characteristics. The Indian Air Force has frozen the preliminary staff qualitative requirement for the AMCA, and the rollout of the first AMCA will happen in 2024. He also said that the configuration of the twin-engine deck-based fighter will be frozen by mid-2021, and its rollout will happen in 2025, and both the AMCA and twin-engine deck-based fighter will have DSI intakes that will improve the aircraft's very low observable characteristics by eliminating radar reflections. After the recent delivery of retractable landing gear systems for the Swift UCAF technology demonstrator, new reports indicate that the Aeronautical Development Agency will start flight testing in March 2021, during which a number of critical parameters and technologies will be validated, which includes testing of a light and compact automatic takeoff and landing system, critical FADS algorithms, conformal phase array antenna for communication and data sharing, fluidic thrust vectoring, low observability features, and the performance of the indigenously developed radar absorbing stealth material against different radar frequencies. The stealth has been a prime focus of the Aura program, and its internal bay will carry precision-guided systems like the DRDO-developed Smart Anti-Airfield System, Israeli Spice 500 and the French Hammer, that will target high-value enemy targets, suppress enemy air defense systems, and it will also be equipped with air-to-air -air missiles in advanced blocks in the future. The Russian embassy in India had hosted an event yesterday, in honor of the first group of the Indian military specialists that are heading to Moscow for the S-400 air defense systems training course, as Russia is looking to supply the first batch of the S-400 system to India in September. Russia will introduce the S-500 system with the Russian military by the end of 2021, and it will be available for exports for all partner countries including India and China by 2025, and Russia could also use the S-500 as diplomatic leverage to win the support of countries that are currently supporting sanctions on Russia. The European defence manufacturer MBDA has said that the company will showcase its MPP 5th generation anti-tank missile, and this 5 km range system has been designed for dismounted infantry as well as for integration on combat vehicles. MBDA has said that the technology is developed in the MMP anti-tank system will be further developed in India in partnership with Larsen and Tubro, that will cater for the specific operational requirements of the Indian Armed Forces. The company will also display its 40 km range Sea Scepter next generation ship based air defense system and the 100 km range Marty extended range third generation anti ship missile at the Aero India 2021, 
and both these systems have been offered to the Indian Navy.